Hey, welcome to a new video. We as humans share our planet with an enormous number of animals, including insects. Recent studies indicate there are 200 million insects for every person on Earth. It's only natural then that there are dangerous species among them. Are you new to this channel? Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And before we start, also like the video. The first insect on this list is none other than the average housefly. Generally speaking, they are nothing more than an annoying insect pest, but I can hear you thinking, flies aren't dangerous, are they? In some cases, they are. The average housefly is believed to be able to transmit at least 65 diseases and 350 types of bacteria. These bacteria can lead from fever to tuberculosis to leprosy. If that doesn't sound bad enough, you haven't seen the world's largest fly. Meet the Garamitis heros, a fly that can grow as long as 7 centimeters. Just imagine for a moment that this fly is flying in your home. This fly is found in countries such as Bolivia, Paraguay, and Brazil. Make sure you don't leave any unattended food lying around, because flies love to eat it. By its very name, the tarantula hawk immediately conjures up an image of fear. This insect is actually a spider killer which has a fondness for larger spiders, particularly tarantulas. They use their sting to put their tarantula prey into a deep paralysis before taking it back to the nest as live food. However, there's a tarantula hawk species that feeds quite separately on just some nectar from flowers. Of the carnivores among them, it's mainly the females that are very skilled at hunting tarantulas. Their sting, which can last about 5 minutes, is called by many one of the most painful insect stings in the world. One researcher who has experienced it firsthand describes it as an immediate and excruciating pain that simply takes away your ability to do anything but scream. This would really be true, as even insect researcher Justin Smith says it's extremely painful. The Puss Caterpillar is a butterfly with long hair that reminds you of a Persian cat. And no, this is not a friendly Pokemon, as this insect is among one of the most poisonous insects in the world. You can find them mainly in Mexico and the eastern United States. It's actually the larvae that make the insects so dangerous, so it's best not to touch them. They have brush-like hairs, which are accompanied by orange stripes across their back. They have brush-like hairs, which are accompanied by an orange stripe across their back. However, these hide a secret weapon, poisonous spines. If they make contact with your skin, you will experience indescribable pain. This is because the venom of this caterpillar spreads throughout your body. If you have been stung, it is recommended to immediately clean the wound and first remove the hairs that are stuck in your skin. A wasp can be found almost all over the world. They are very useful because they eat flies and mosquitoes. You've probably seen them flying around in your garden or on your balcony. But did you know that there are more than 75,000 different species? One of them is the yellow jacket, which you can mainly find in North America. Unlike the wasps that usually leave you alone, this wasp is notorious for its aggressiveness. If someone accidentally gets too close to one of the underground nests, their alarm signal will summon hundreds of stinging wasps to attack. Unlike bees, these yellow-colored insects do not lose their stinger. So they don't just sting you once, but they will repeatedly attack and sting you purely out of aggression. In some cases, their sting can even be deadly. I can already see you thinking, how can beetles be dangerous? In the world, there are said to be over 350,000 different species of beetle, so it's only natural that there are dangerous species among them. Some of them can actually bite you. Let's start with the titan beetle, one of the largest insects in the world, measuring nearly 17 centimeters in length. They live mainly in rainforests, and their lower jaw are powerful enough to break pencils in half, let alone pierce human flesh. Another species are the Hercules beetles, which belong to a group called rhino beetles. The males can grow as long as 19 centimeters. They are also quite muscular, and they are capable of carrying up to 850 times their body mass. Compared to an adult male, that would mean they could carry as much as 68,000 kilograms. But the most dangerous beetle species is probably the blister beetle. If you come into contact with this beetle, then you can get irritation and blisters that can be very painful. Another dangerous species that should also be mentioned is the rove beetle. These beetles carry a toxic chemical compound called paterin. This can cause bumps with a burning sensation from which some people get high fevers and body pains. 
It could even make you blind, so beware of this insect. At first glance, the brown recluse spider can often be confused with the average brown spider, but you can distinguish them by their eyes. In fact, they have eerie rows of six eyes instead of eight like most spiders. But this spider is among the most dangerous spiders in the world because they are incredibly venomous. After you are bitten, you get dark blisters and sores that can last for weeks. In the same place, your skin can also show extreme reactions, including rotting tissue. Fortunately, these spiders are only found in South and Central United States. In addition, they like dark, hidden places like rocks or under leaves. However, they are also sometimes found in homes, and even in people's shoes. Unlike the average bee, these hornets have a sting that is made to do maximum damage. The bald-faced hornets can sting you repeatedly, so it's best to stay away from these insects. Any predator or intruder they see as a threat, remember that you are dealing with an insect that likes to chew up bees rather than avoid them. The sting of these insects have a venom that can last 24 hours and is extremely painful and especially dangerous near your face or eyes. People who have experienced this have reported everything from difficulty breathing and swallowing problems. In other cases, people had severe allergic reactions, and so also had to be taken to the hospital immediately. These blood-sucking insects, called the kissing bugs, are found mainly in Central and South America, certain areas of the United States, and Mexico. If you encounter one, you will quickly discover that they do not kiss their victim, but they bite you in a Dracula-like manner. They prefer to do this when you are sleeping. Like mosquitoes, these creepy crawlers need blood to survive. They have no problem extracting it from anywhere in your body, but you may be wondering why are they called kissing bugs? This is because they get their name from where they like to bite you, which is around the mouth or the eyes. They can bite you up to 15 times, and this bite is not only painful, but can also carry diseases such as Chagas disease. Symptoms of this disease are severe fever, vomiting, anemia, and swelling. In the early stages, this disease can still be treated, but after a few months, it can no longer be treated. So in South America, this disease has become a big problem, and unfortunately, it has caused a very unfortunate fate for many people. The brown tail moth is a moth with tiny poisonous hairs. Fortunately, there are only a few places in the world where this insect is found. This invasive species was accidentally introduced from Europe in 1897 and now is found in the United States on the coast of Massachusetts in Maine. Invasive species actually means that the insect has become greatly overpopulated and is causing damage to its new environment. The butterfly itself would not be too dangerous, but you have to be especially careful when they are still in larva. This is because the larvae are covered in poisonous hairs that can lead to dermatitis in sensitive individuals. Dermatitis causes a serious rash, so try to avoid contact with this dangerous insect at all times. The giant tree weta is one of the largest insects that has ever lived on Earth. They are native to New Zealand. Not only are they one of the largest insects in the world, but they are also considered the heaviest insects in the world. A giant tree weta can weigh about 70 grams. Although they have no sting, they can bite you viciously. Their name comes from the Maori people who first inhabited New Zealand, and it means god of ugly things. So you are dealing with a very old insect. Fossils of giant tree wettas date back to the Triassic period more than 190 million years ago. This means that these insects are older than some dinosaurs. Another strange fact about them is that they have ears on their knees. Probably a mistake by Mother Nature. Botflies, also known as hornet flies, are no bigger than your palm, but they are very terrifying. The botfly is a type of parasitic fly, which means they need a host. And yes, that can include humans. They literally cannot complete their life cycle unless they spend their larval stage in a suitable host. The way they get a host is by depositing their eggs on a blood-eating insect like a mosquito. When that mosquito bites someone, the eggs are transmitted, and the host's body heat encourages the eggs to hatch. The hornet grows 12 to 19 millimeters. The creepy thing about them is that they can even live under your skin. In most cases, the host will survive, but there is a risk that the skin will become infected. 
and this infection can be deadly. However, if you want to remove this parasite, you will need a pair of pliers. Normal bees exist on every continent in the world, except Antarctica. However, the giant honeybee, scientifically called Apis dorsata, lives in the forest of South and Southeast Asia, especially in the Terai forest of Nepal. They are the largest species of honeybee, measuring about 1 inch or 2.5 centimeters in length. Their nests are often built far above the ground in the trees. Being stung by a giant honeybee can cause a range of symptoms from mild allergies, abdominal pains, chest discomfort, severe organ damage, or a serious injury to the intestines. A while back, a group of researchers published a study reporting serious cases of giant honeybee stings in Sri Lanka. One case involved a 7-year-old man who was chased by 200 bees. Because the giant honeybee is rather aggressive species of bee, it's also never kept by beekeepers. Paper wasps are amazing insects. Their round inverted nests are made of paper, from which they get their name. Sometimes they're also called umbrella wasps because their nests resemble that. They are reddish-brown striped wasps that are actually not very good at stinging. However, the sting of a paper wasp feels biting and burning with a distinctly bitter aftertaste. This is because it releases toxins that cause allergic reactions, swelling of the lips or throat. In the worst cases, these can even cause death. Other symptoms include dizziness, vomiting, abdominal cramps, and a rapid heartbeat. Their sting serves as a defense against larger animals, such as birds, dogs, wolves, and humans. The good news, however, is that they do not attack unless they feel threatened. So walk around them with a wide circle. Ants are known to be diligent workers, and the red harvester ant is the best proof of that. These ants are mostly found in the southwestern United States. Their food is seeds, and they eat them in large quantities. With their huge mandibles, they grind the seeds thoroughly and store them in all kinds of granary. These little workers of only 7 millimeters make sure that there's enough food for everyone throughout the year. They are therefore nicknamed the Red Harvester Ant. The Red Harvester Ant is not only a great food gatherer, but also a dreaded pricker. Some species have barbed spines that can break the skin. However, they can even be nastier, as they can sting multiple times. The effect of their sting can travel along lymphatic ducts and cause serious damage. Their venom consists of amino acids, peptides, proteins, and an alkaloid venom that acts as a pheromone. This means that a single harvester ant can summon a whole outfit of weapons when a threat arises. So imagine if you encountered a whole army of these types of ants. Native to Central and South America, the warrior wasp, or Sinoeca, is notorious for its enormously painful sting. Unlike most insects, which only attack when provoked, the warrior wasp is naturally aggressive. According to the insect researcher Justin Schmidt, who wrote the book, The Sting of the Wild, the sting of this insect feels like you are chained in the current of an active volcano. You will find it almost impossible to imagine the pain of it. In addition to its sting, the wasp has another way of scaring its enemies in advance. They are known for aggressively flapping their wings up and down together. For this reason, they have earned the nickname Drumming Wasps. This also usually deters predators, but if this doesn't work, their sting is the second defense option. The Velvet Ant also has another much more terrifying name, which is the Cow Killer. But don't worry, there is no known case where this insect has killed a cow. The name only describes how painful the sting of the insect can be. According to those who have experienced such a thing, this pain is said to be unbearable. Although the velvet ant has the name ant in its name, it's actually not an ant, but a wasp. The reason is, is that it's often mistaken for an ant, because the female is wingless. A less fun fact about this wasp is the way the females lay their eggs. Instead of building her own nest, she takes over the nest of the species. And when the larva hatches, she eats the host's pupa. The velvet ant's ferocity is compounded by its many forms of defensive weapons, including its chemical defense odor, thickened external skeleton, warning sounds, and of course, its venom. The doryless ant, also known as the driver ants, have colonies with sometimes more than 20 million different individuals. They are mainly found in Central and Eastern Africa, and in certain tropical parts of Asia. These ants are carnivores, and their food consists mainly of earthworms. But they are also known to attack animals that don't get out of their way fast enough. 
Now, it's common knowledge that only red fire ants can bite, but this is not the case. There are more than 12,000 species of ants that can do this. However, the doorless ant uses its scissor-like jaws to bite its prey. And when they feel threatened, they use these jaws on humans. Those that have had this experience say that removing this ant can be difficult because their jaws are extremely strong. Not to mention the fact that the bite is very painful. Insect researcher Justin Schmidt didn't just write the book, The Sting of the Wild. To write the book, he studied various insect stings by experiencing them firsthand. During this process, he created the Schmidt Sting Pain Index, which he used to rank the stings. The insect at the top of this index is none other than the bullet ant, so named because its sting is similar to a gunshot wound. In Venezuela, he is also known as a 24-hour ant, because the victim either suffers an entire day of pain or dies within 24 hours. Let's believe the words of Dr. Schmidt and stay far away from this insect. In fact, he describes the sting of the bullet ant as pure, intense, and exceptional pain. Although Justin Schmidt says the bullet ant has the most painful sting, many other people, including YouTuber and wildlife expert Coyote Peterson, say the executioner wasp is the most painful of all. Justin Schmidt, in fact, has never been stung by this wasp so he did not include it in his pain index. Coyote, however, has experienced the pain of a bullet ant, as well as the executioner wasp, and says the wasp was many times more painful. Within seconds of being stung, Coyote cried out in pain and says his skin burned very badly. The throbbing pain he suffered is due to the wasp's venom, which is pushed into the skin. This venom causes premature cell death in living tissues. Coyote's arm was therefore swollen for days, and he even retained a small hole at the sting area. Based on this experience, Coyote labeled the Executioner Wasp as the king of the stings. The Killer Bee is the nickname of the Africanized honeybee, which was a crossing between the East African honeybee and several European honeybee species. They are originally from Brazil and have now taken over parts of South to Central America. This bee species is called Killer Bee for a reason. They can hunt hundreds of people at a time if you disturb them, and they are responsible for more than 1,000 human deaths. A Killer Bee can sting 10 times more than any other species, making it very dangerous. In October 2010, a 73-year-old man was clearing up bushes when he accidentally disrupted a beehive. As you can guess, he didn't stand a chance against hundreds of bees. There's also stories of bees chasing people for over 400 yards or 400 meters. If you don't like centipedes, you definitely don't want to encounter the giant centipede. They are mainly found in the south of America, where it's tropical and as the name suggests, they are huge. They are one of the largest centipedes in the world and can reach a length of 12 inches or 30 centimeters. Believe it or not, this Chinese man even bought one as a pet. They are known as aggressive hunters and can easily overpower spiders, scorpions, and other large insects. If this centipede encounters a larger animal, they can use their venom to hold their own in battle. Fortunately, people are rarely bitten, but when they are, it's extremely painful. The symptoms you might get from the poison are fever, nausea, and problems with your cardiovascular system. They are also a very nasty plague for farmers and people who love gardening. The Australian funnel spider, also known as the Atracidae, is considered the most deadly spider in the world. Fortunately, it's only found in the east of Australia. The spider has at least 40 subspecies, but they are not all equally dangerous. However, some, like the Australian funnel spider, have very strong poisons that act quickly on you. The symptoms you might get is the cramping of the heart and muscles. 13 people would not have survived after touching the spider, but fortunately, an antidote was developed in 1981, and since then, there have been no new victims. So if you decide to go on vacation to Australia, and you are in the vicinity of humid forest areas, beware. Because even if there is an antidote, the bite is still very painful. I myself don't like a small spider, but if I met this spider, it would scare the hell out of me. The assassin caterpillar, as the insect is called, is mainly found in the rainforest of southern Brazil, and is known as the most dangerous caterpillar in the world. It also earned a place in the Guinness World Records as the most poisonous caterpillar. You should never touch this caterpillar because first of all, their body destroys your red blood cells. They can grow between 1.3 to 1.8 inches, or 4.5 to 5.5 centimeters tall. And what makes them especially dangerous is that you can barely see them, because they can camouflage themselves perfectly in a tree bark. However, if you find one, there's a good chance that there are several of them around, because they often live in groups. 
The Asian giant hornet is an insect that has been spreading more and more over the last few years. You can find them in the tropical regions of China, Japan, and India. Since 2020, there would have been reports of a number of them being found in America, and this can become a big problem. First of all, they can reach a length of almost 3 inches, or 7 centimeters. And secondly, they can exterminate hundreds of bees at the same time. And this is a big problem, because the bees are important for pollinating our food crops. Beekeepers are therefore very concerned about the growing population of these hornets. But these hornets can also be dangerous for humans. Their sting is very poisonous and painful, and in Japan alone, these hornets cause 50 deaths a year. Fire ants are known as ants that can sting, and are therefore very feared. Normal ants bite and inject acid into the wound, but fire ants bite and inject venom. This poison can often kill smaller animals. For humans, the sting may not be a serious threat, but it is very painful. In 5% of the cases, it can cause people to suffocate due to an allergic reaction. As the name suggests, these fire ants leave a burning sensation on the skin. Fire ants are also known for their ability to seriously affect nature reserves. In the United States alone, more than $5 billion a year is spent on medical treatment, damage, and control of these insects. The most dangerous insect on this list, and how could it be otherwise? It's the mosquito. Mosquitoes feed on the blood of animals, but also humans. Blood is full of proteins that mosquitoes need to produce eggs. Their bites cause an itchy rash, because their saliva is transmitted during the bite. Like ticks, mosquitoes transmit diseases to humans and animals. According to various data, they are responsible for the deaths of more than 700,000 people a year. Africa, South America, and Asia are said to be affected by most mosquito populations. Some of the diseases that mosquitoes can transmit are Zika virus, West Nile virus, and malaria. Have you ever come across a dangerous insect? Let me know in the comments. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos we've made, click one on the screen or take a look at the channel. Thanks for watching. See you next time.